Hello, I'm Bradley Fair, editor of the Journal of Commerce, and this is what you can look forward to next week in print and online. Staff writer Richard Gilbert has a story about the United Steelworkers Union challenging the ownership claims of a Vancouver-based mining company. Haiyang Holdings is importing temporary foreign workers from China, and the United Steelworkers Union has released a report questioning whether the company has ties to the Chinese government. Correspondent Carol Christian has an article about construction crews battling extremely cold temperatures in Fort McMurray, Alberta. And correspondent Peter Kender has a story about Aboriginal governments and their role in P3 projects. And colonist Stephen Bald explains how to use defensive tactics to avoid bid rigging. Make sure to watch our latest feature video about the Evergreen Line, one of the biggest projects in the Lower Mainland going forward in 2013. All this and more in print and online at the Journal of Commerce and journalofcommerce.com. I'm <laughs> sorry.